Governor Malloy is saying the state's big investment in that genome research lab is already paying dividends. The dividend came today with the announcement that Jackson Labs is starting a major partnership with cancer researchers here in Connecticut. Chief political correspondent Mark Davis joins us live to explain how it all works. Mark? Hi, Sonia and Darren. Good evening, everyone, from the Hartford Newsroom. Yeah, this partnership is an example of the modern personalized medicine of the future. The nearly billion dollar Jackson Labs project on the campus of the Yukon Medical Center in Farmington is now well underway. Some continue to question the state's nearly $300 million investment in the deal. In a relatively short period of time, uh, we are seeing uh, what we said would happen actually happen. Even though the day when researchers will actually work in this building is still in the future, it was announced today that Jackson Labs will immediately start to partner with cancer specialists at Hartford Hospital and the Connecticut Children's Medical Center on a bold move forward in treatment. The concept is called the cancer avatar. It combines the Jackson Laboratory technologies to grow patient tumors in surrogate mice for detailed drug testing. At the Jackson Labs facility in Maine, they produce laboratory mice with no immune system. They will give the mice a patient's specific cancer and then test various drugs and other medical treatments to see what works. When they find one, it can then be administered to the patient. With this approach, what we hope to do is target the drugs to the mechanisms of the tumor and avoid a whole bunch of other side effects that are really harmful to kids. The idea of this is to try and find therapy that's highly likely to work, getting up to more of the 70 or 80 or 90 percent chance that it'll work, and at the same time, it's so targeted that it's much less likely to cause toxicity. Now, and right now, they, they will give you several treatments until one works, and the side effects can be miserable. This way, if the treatment can be tailor-made to your cancer, a lot of those side effects will be avoided. And they say it'll be faster. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.